So you get drafted right in the first round and then you say well I'll go through the minor leagues and then I'll make it to the majors at some point hopefully soon. Hopefully soon is a couple months later for young Garrett Crochet 21 years old the left hander with the fastball and the wipeout slider who comes out of the University of Tennessee to the Chicago White Sox 11th overall 2020 draft he's out of the state of Mississippi talking to him a little bit during the early part of the pandemic just for about 20 minutes on Skype. He is a very confident young man. He believes in his abilities. He's got a nasty slider and you see Chris Sale reaching the majors the year being drafted back in 2010. There have been some comparisons not from Sox people but just the profile of crochet tall slender lefty with a wipeout slider to a guy like Chris Sale. Well I mean obviously you're going to draw the comparisons because it's the nearest thing to Chris Sale that right. we've had and here he is a guy that throws this hard and has that slider like Chris Sale has had over his career but the difference is what I have checked numbers wise you know you're going off a of potential with crochet because his numbers in college just weren't wipe out numbers and to me that means he was just overthrowing the baseball. First pitch down and away 88 miles an hour but the, I mean this is really a no lose situation for the Sox you're walking up toward the playoffs you know that for sure and you get crochet into a 6 1 game in Cincinnati. Perfect right. Mm -hmm. Well Yasmani Grandal just got shocked <laughs> by that breaking ball upstairs. Well and then he just he, he he pointed to his eyes like I couldn't see it. So I don't know what exactly that meant or. Maybe he's telling them, hey, check the signs a little better. <laughs> that may have been one finger. <laughs> uh, you know, you, you, you crossed me up. One and one is, oh boy, a fastball at 100. That'll knock you off the plate pretty quick if you're Brian Goodwin, uh, who has no tape of crochet from the minors. <laughs> you got to watch SEC Network. Yeah, th this is interesting. I talk about all legs coming at you, by the way, Garrett Crochet. <laughs> Let me let me just explain what I'm seeing right now Jason um, that last fastball at 100 miles an hour from the delivery he's featuring it, it seems effortless and it, for a hitter you know it's there before you can even think about it. Well you can see why Mike Shirley and the Sox staff love the arm. Oh I can definitely see that and numbers wise the, the key is going to be can he command the strike zone I think it can be taught. As you see the high leg kick and the definite drive long stride and creating a lot of torque with that upper body. 100 strike three Garrett Crochet keep that baseball his first major league strikeout just a couple of months after he was drafted. How about his year. Well, I mean look we've talked about how bad 2020 has been for the world and for the nation but right now Garrett Crochet. He couldn't think this is a better year in his whole life. The dream come true. First big league batter faced and he strikes him out just like his dream probably has been forever to get to the big leagues with this arm and strike guys out. Right now just stop in this moment who's having a better 2020 than Garrett Crochet <laughs> across the world. <laughs> no one. First pitch fouled away at 100 strike one. You know we can also draw a quick comparison to uh, Randy Johnson when he first got to the big leagues. Hmm. He threw two pitches he threw a fastball and an occasional slider that he couldn't command and then he figured out how to throw that for a strike and everything changed. One oh one on the fastball and easy for Garrett Crochet. Well you know right now I just look at uh, Yasmani Grandal he's looking at his glove his mitt he's going wait a minute is it OK. Think about having to catch that it doesn't feel good on the hand if you miss catch it just a little bit. Start calling a lot more sliders. Oh two fastball inside get out of here two down Garrett Crochet is carving. <laughs> it makes me think about Amir Garrett the short reliever for the Reds that's watching this going. OK hold on is this guy trying to copy me. As Garrett Amir Garrett has a huge late kick as well and a good fastball not at this speed. But this is something special to watch right now and let's see him do it again. How about Tucker Barnhart lefty lefty good luck to you and here's the last pitch. 
And you can actually see that uh, Crochet, he pulls his head off of target. As violent as that delivery is at the finish, his head kind of pulls down. He loses sight of the target, but he's already locked it in in his mind when he's releasing the baseball. And it's going in the direction he's hoping it ends up. <laughs> right? Uh, he's, he's, he's right on top of you. So perceived velocity, right? You're, you're, it's 100. Yes. You're seeing 102, 103, aren't you? Well, absolutely. From the release point, because he's a bigger, taller guy. Contact to first. Yeah, we can get used to this. Ooh, doctor. Garrett Crochet, when Flamingos attack,